Good afternoon, everybody. It's Dave with Alaskan Homesteading. I hope you're having a great day. On my last video, I made uh, a really pretty dangerous mistake, and I wanted to address that here just because I did get some comments about it, and uh, I went and did a little bit more reading and educated myself and found that, in fact, uh, I violated my own rules. Do not dumb here. That spray can of uh, brake cleaner contains some chemicals that can be very dangerous under the wrong conditions. And in particular, uh, some folks mentioned it can turn into phosgene, and, and that's accurate. I went and reread the, the can labeling and saw that, uh, that information on the back. The trouble is all this stuff is in fine print. It's, uh, you know, you really have to pay attention to what you're using when you're working in your shop. So uh, I, I'll show you what's on the can so that you can see the information that I'm talking about. And uh, hopefully I can prevent somebody else from making the same uh, dangerous error that I did. So this is what I'm talking about when I mentioned the instructions on the can. There's a lot of fine print on these products. And what I neglected to do was to really read all of this stuff in detail. And the important part, the one that could potentially get you killed is this part about the tetrachloroethylene um, and the risks that it carries when you heat it up. So if you read here, it says, when exposed to extreme heat, vapors may decompose to corrosive and toxic gases such as hydrogen chloride and possibly phosgene. And so when I was doing that video with the Chinese diesel heater, cleaning up the inside of it and using this brake clean, non-flammable, I made a really potentially very dangerous error. I was lucky and, you know, I opened the door to ventilate the space that I was working in. But the reality is, if you aren't careful with some of these chemicals that you can find in your garage, uh, you can really, really hurt yourself or, or even cause much, much worse problems. Well, anyway, so I've shown you what's on the can. Uh, I have hopefully kind of helped folks who might have seen that video yesterday uh, see the the dangerous mistake that I made and uh, learn from it. Um, do not dumb here. <laughs> I need to remind myself of that sometimes. Anyway, thank you to those who commented. It was uh, definitely appreciated. I, uh, I, I definitely think it's important to uh, to address these kinds of safety concerns in our in our home workshops. Thanks for watching, and uh, if you like this kind of content, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. If you want to see more of it, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you in the next video.